New Year's resolutions in 2024 don't really work when it comes to dating women. Welcome to the Dating Women Radio Show, episode number 28. Doc Love, the man that interviewed thousands of women, asking them why they chose one man versus another, talks about why the men that are most successful in dating and life make success principles a part of their DNA, and not just when the calendar turns to a new year. Now, this is an interview style, as Doc was on the radio for 20-plus years, and I had the honor of interviewing him to expand on his material. So let's find out about Doc's take on New Year's resolutions. Now, Doc's been gone since 2020, but his principles are timeless. Had he been around now, he'd say the same thing because his coaching on New Year's resolutions never changed. And forget about all the advice you're hearing from the New Year's resolutions. Forget about make this your best year ever nonsense. Doc, when you're a system guy, you're always striving to improve. You don't need the calendar to turn to January 1st to be the best version of yourself, correct? You know, it's really funny. You know how many people join the gym January 1st, and in April and May, the gym is empty? A ton of people. A ton of people. A ton of people, yeah, yeah. And that's what you got to be. You just got to chug along. You got to be consistent. Throw stuff out of your apartment. Clean up the car. You know, look at your wardrobe. Make sure you got a good barber, you know, and hang around positive people and don't run around with any bums or losers, even though you guys go back 100 years, because you're going to learn nothing from them. And they keep playing the same tape every time you talk to them anyway. It's not being cruel, but don't go out of your time to spend, spend with somebody who doesn't want to be successful in life and improve the world. They're not worth what it. Is, what is that, Doc? It's like you're the average of the five people you hang around. And yeah, all the, all the self-help books that. You're in the middle, and you've got two guys on your right and your left, and you're, yeah. like, the, you're like those four. And are, they, are those four dragging you up, or, or are they bringing you down? That's what you've got yeah. to ask yourself. Spend your, spend, and then you, have, then you have a couple of good buddies. You've got an idea about business or something's going on in your life. You get to hit off these two people, and they're going to give you great advice because they're not losers. You're going to think, thanks a lot, guys. I don't have to see a shrink now for 300 bucks. That's what good buddies are for. But that's what you, what you want to do. You want to be the little engine that could. Just have that pace, and uh, the, tortoise, the tortoise beats the hare because the little tortoise never gave up. And the rabbit says, ah, I'm way ahead. I can take a little rest. I don't need to read the system anymore. I got this down. Then he runs into Miss Wright and makes every blunder in the world. He says, you know what? I don't think I should have taken that vacation from the system. I might have been able to keep this girl. Yeah, you don't want to do that and start over again. Because you're getting older and you don't look as good as before. Remember, the clock's ticking against you. So let's get to that good one. Freeze your screen now as you can get a discount on Doc's book that's changed thousands of lives around the world, plus a free seven-day dating course, plus more.